Hello my fellow warmongers and how is everyone doing on this fine day? Alright alright it's Fair War here and welcome to another live battle cast for Total War Warhammer. So guys it's been long, it's been hectic, I haven't been uploading for quite a while, been on a vacation outside of Egypt, outside of my hometown I mean. Yep, didn't have my awesome desktop computer with me so couldn't really upload anything. So, so yeah, need to get back on the bounty wall been getting some bounties there's a lot of claims need to check up on the bounty wall as well check on the excel sheet add it add to it the new bounties you know do the right stuff so we're going against empire greenskins again actually let's go beat no i i always do beastmen a lot in live battle cast let's do greenskins so for empire should we go Wurzag? Wurzag is pretty expensive yeah why the hell not let's do Wurzag. Let's put him on Splinter Reaper. Let's remove Foe Seeker and the rest. Where's Zag's Revenge? All right, that's cool. 50% miscast. That's quite that's quite awesome, actually. War Pain of Warzag, Power of the War. Yeah, that's all cool. Bone Old Staff, of course. And Squiggly Beast is gonna be like 3,000. Oh, so freaking expensive. All right, there. Eh, very expensive. If I lose him, I lose the game. Let's get him like uh, freaking bodyguards. Two spiders, one wolf. Remove all slippery. Remove slippery. Remove slippery and remove slippery. We got 8k left. So we're going against Empire. So we'll go for Savage Orcs. Um, Hammer Gork. Nah, let's go. Let's go rock and heavy on him. Rusty Airs. Night Goblin Archers, actually Goblin Archers or Night Goblin, let's stick to Goblin Archers. So four Savage Orcs, let's do three Savage Orc Biggins, two Orc Boar Boy Biggins, a Goblin Wolf Rider and a Moon Howler. Yep, I like this actually, this looks good. Got 162, maybe give some ups to these guys. Yeah, okay. This is cool. This is cool. I like this. It's an all Savage Orc army. With these guys. Maybe, um... No, nah, actually, let's switch it up. Let's do something else. Give me this guy. Remove this. Remove that. Remove that. Remove that and that. 806. Okay, that's not cool. Come on, get the 900. Yes, baby! We got the 900. Alright, that works. Move that. Get one of those. Actually, no, it's the same. All right, that works. That works. Let's do this. Let's hope he's not a cheeser. Been getting cheesed a lot these days. So, uh, yeah, I, I I was asked before why on what basis I would choose my build. So my builds consist of savage orcs because of their damage resistance and their high weapon strength. So most and most empire empire. We'll get like, um, can I get a, a, sp a spider? No, I can't get a spider, right? Too much, of course. Can I remove anything from here? Of course I can't remove anything. Ah, this sucks, this sucks. Needed that guy on a spider. I need that guy on a spider. Well, yeah, okay. So, as I was saying, for for my build, Savage Orc Frontline will just destroy any Empire Frontline they will have. Except if they will have like Heavy Cav Force, Heavy Cav Force, I'll need to switch it up. Put the Biggins in front, put the uh, put the normal Savage Orcs on the flanks, and then just put the Orc Boar Boy Biggins in the back to defend my back lines, defend the Archers. But if, he's, if he went heavy on crossbows, yeah, that's going to be a problem. Wurzag with his uh, power of the Wa, here we go, and all his beautiful stuff, just increase melee attack on all the army, then hopefully, yeah. So I've been trying to figure out how, <sighs> my mic is always very close to the mouse, so as you can see, it's pretty annoying. I know, I know, I've got a, I got some comments about it, like the, you, ca you guys can hear the mouse from the, uh... alright, so he went with a normal army, this is awesome. Let's put these guys here. Savage Orc front line. Begins. Put them on the flanks like this. Other begins here. These guys are on three. These guys are on four. 
two three we i want you guys at the back over here please oh yeah this is beautiful and also as you can see here they're actually they can be seen easily on the mini map they have to be like so let's try to hide them more a little more it's not working come on man make it work make it work well yeah as you can see on the mini map over there they're not they're not like if someone looks at the mini map, mini map they won't be able to see them which is always great yeah okay depends if he's if he's going to really focus on the mini map or not it's for all you you put you guys here you want goblins some over here rusty airs some over here put you right next to them and these all of you here are on one and we lock you let's relock you so guys game plan the night goblin shaman will cast night shroud on the empire artillery if he has some and then just like you know try to get in some damage you know get some cool stuff in and with night shroud he, he he won't be able to see my army most probably which will give me a better shot at like coming in with the moon howlers and the other goblins oh yeah these guys are hidden in trees awesome okay this is great this is great and also as you can see i named my group one three and four wow a temple half lumerarch damn pretty gutsy who's the lord carl franz wow okay i gotta hand it up to the guy he, he deserves a freaking like i don't know but freaking something f for that big guts of his so as you can see with night shroud i covered all his army so what we want to do is we want to push up this guy what's the range of it beautiful okay so we cast this here Okay, everything now is hidden. He can't he can't see anything. What's he shooting at? What is he fucking shooting at? Oh fuck. That hurt like shit. I'm sure he's got calf hidden somewhere. Should have tried like to, you know, avoid that a little. Didn't work though. You guys coming close these guys are already very close let's okay that's that's awesome you went into the temple half in the woods this is what we want actually okay you guys are on two and also with night shroud on all of them yep exactly this is what we want Okay, let's avoid the net let's avoid the net okay this is get in on him you guys get in here where's ag cast in here we go on these guys over there yep one howlers got in the back these other guys are getting in here okay this is good you want these guys to flank you too Get in on the uh, hand gunners. We want Wurzak close as well to get like that beautiful like damage resist he always puts.
Get in the back of those, please. Where is that? Cast wall. Let's break through that line here. Get in on her. Get in on that Luminarch. You don't want it fighting. We don't want it fighting. Yup. That is beautiful. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. You guys push here. You guys push here. What? What the hell? He killed him in like two hits. Well, we're still gonna win it. We can do it. We can do it, you guys. Get in on Carl Franz, please. How's the flanks? Hit these spearmen. Rusty airs, you guys. Let's let's bring back all the routing units. Carl Franz killed my unit. Killed Warzak in two hits. Two freaking hits. Get in on him. Get in on that fucker. Get in on him. Actually, no. Don't get in on him. Where's the wolves? Where are my wolves? Back. We got a very strong pocket here. Of Savage Orcs, this is working, this is working. Get on these handgunners, get in on those handgunners. Oh shit, that is bad. That is so freaking bad. We got a very strong blob here. Let's remove the auto lock. Let's remove the lock. Okay, Carl Franz is gonna die now. I hope. Yeah, with the rusty air shooting at him, he's definitely gonna die. Goblin War Boss, get in on these two little fuckers over there. Fuck him up, fuck him up, yeah! Go for it! All you, get in on them. The rest, get in, get in here, push him. Push, push! Alright, that's working, this is working. Alright, that was a complete micro blunder. There was not one point of good micro I did in that game. Yeah, well, let's check the stats. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. Freaking Warzag did absolutely nothing. One hit from Carl Franz and he's just gone. My God. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for watching. Uh, don't forget to check out the bounty wall. You know, like I'll put down the links for the bounty wall, how to post a bounty and all that. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you in the next video. Cheers and have a nice day.